Hello and welcome to a, another video from me, Penultimate Dave. So today I thought I would show you something different. Uh, seeing that we use our, our fountain pens to write with most of the time, whether or not it's journaling or whether or not it's writing letters. A lot of people actually have pen pals and, and write letters to each other. Uh, I'm based in the UK and the UK actually has uh, quite a rich set of, uh, of varying stamps that you can put on envelopes. Uh, some of them come in various price ranges, like a first class stamp, uh, I think is 67p or 68p, and then uh, you can get valued versions of stamps for, for heavier envelopes or jiffy bags that you want to send. So I thought I would show you today just some of the stamps that we have. These are some of the stamps I have left in my collection uh, that I put onto stamps uh, or onto um, envelopes uh, every day when I send out letters. So this one here is um, Windsor Castle and you can see uh, these are very sort of photorealistic uh, stamps. Uh, the Long Walk of Windsor Castle uh, the Round Tower of Windsor Castle is a lovely stamp. One of my favourites though is the Norman Gate. That is just an amazing photo there. Uh, I do like photos of castles, uh, so I do like these stamps. Um, now these are available, sometimes you can buy these in post offices, uh, or you can buy them on uh, royalmail.com. So, uh, and you don't, I don't think you have to be in the UK to buy these stamps. I think you can buy them anywhere in the world. So that, that's just one set of stamps. And I have another set here, um, which are windmills. And I sort of zoom in a little bit here. You can see you have uh, varying windmills and uh, flint mills there and um, Woodchurch Windmill, um, Nutley Windmill, uh, some really really nice windmills. Uh, so uh, I thought that, that again is a nice set. So some of these are as you can see are first class stamps, some of them are like £1.57 uh, and then the ones on the left here are like £1.40. So uh, if you're sending overseas it's normally about £1.40 for a 20 gram envelope or £1.44 I believe now, so or 48 so um, yeah. And then uh, you have these lovely uh, uh, recent edition of Game of Thrones stamps. So you can see um, Sansa Stark, Tyrone Lannister, Jon Snow, Cursal Lannister, Eddard Stark, Arya Stark, Elena Tyrell, Jamie Lannister, Tywin Lannister, and Daenerys Targaryen with her lovely, lovely dragons there. So you can see these stamps are actually really, really detailed. Like I say, you can buy all of these on worldmail.com if you want them. They are normally limited edition sets, so um, when they're gone, they're gone. Um, they're not around forever, so buy them when you can. Uh, and then we have some Star Wars ones, and these I do like. So here you got Darth Vader, you have Yoda, um, you have lots of different lovely lovely stamps there, you know, Chewbacca, Obi-Wan Kenobi, Stormtrooper, and you got Han Solo there, and Rey as well. So these are very, very detailed stamps. Really, really nice. So that's a, a, another Star Wars set that I have. Uh, I have this Star Wars set as well. So you have uh, the top ones that are called droids, or actually even the bottom ones here. Um, so they're called droids. You have BB-8 there. You have R2-D2, C-3PO. And of course you have Princess Leia there as well, the Emperor. Another C-3PO there. And these ones, there's a few duplicated here. You can see you got Boba Fett even there. You got Finn. 
it's just amazing. Ray, Han Solo, Stormtrooper, Obi Wan Kenobi. Just stunning, stunning stamps. And then here you have also some lovely Harry Potter stamps. So you can see here you've got Dundledorf and Lord Voldemort. Voldemort, so. And these are all first class stamps. So I end up, when I'm sending international stamps to the US, normally end up putting three first class stamps uh, on an envelope. Uh, if it's uh, to mainland Europe, it's normally a couple, uh, and if it's to the UK, normally one stamp. So, uh, and you can also get these uh, like packs, so like heroes and villains for Harry Potter, and they actually give you these sort of posters as well. So, um, and they actually come with the stamps as a stamp set. So, uh, so I thought I would show you just a few of the stamps there that I have in in my collection. Uh, I don't collect these per se, so uh, these just go straight onto envelopes. But um, I'd rather actually put these on there than just regular Queen's Head stamps, really, most of the time. So I, I would just rather do that. So thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you on the next pen video. Bye bye.